Hey, what's up, y'all? I am. Welcome to my channel. What is up? What is it? I'm sitting in my doorway because mosquitoes be trying to bite people like me. So, I guess I got some special blood or something. So, yeah. Sitting in my doorway while my child is outside to play. But, I want to come over here and talk about celebrity worship. Celebrity worship is really getting on my fucking nerves. Celebrity worship, sports worship. Um, if you don't, if you worship anything outside of yourself, something wrong with you. If you believe that these celebrities is what they say they is, something wrong with you. Like, I, it, it, it really takes a special individual to go hard for a person that they don't know personally. That they have absolutely don't know no truths about. All they know is what's been posted online. But they be riding for these people. Like this shit is irky as hell. This shit is irky as hell. And I was just watching a uh, so called reader. Tarot reader. She's talking about celebrities. I'm not going to say nobody's name on here. Because yeah. And um. I'm reading the comments. Because I, I told you I go straight to the comments. <laughs> Cause I be trolling on the low, so I go straight to the comment. But I, I be trolling in my in my as myself. So I'm right, I'm not really trolling because I'm still me. Like I don't create profiles to troll. I'm troll as me. So um, I'm in the comments and I'm just looking like all of this fucking Nikki, this Nikki, that Nikki, this Nikki, that Nikki, right? Nikki, this Nikki, this. No, she don't. No, she don't. All you got to do is go look up the credits. Like, that's the shit that pisses me off about the sheep. Like, all you got to do is go check the credits, my nigga. She is not on one song by herself. Period. Not one. I don't know no rap artist that doesn't have any type of writers on they, on they shit. And some singers, too. I, I've only really came across very few. I could probably count on my hand singers that don't have no other writing credits on they shit and one off the top of my head right now is chloe and holly yeah chloe and holly a lot of their writing credits is just them i'm not saying all of them but a lot of them because i was listening to them before they became what they are now um their writing credits if you go look at their credits they'll be the only two people on there but just go look it's just a simple google search and it's just so fucking sad that people worship these fucking people that they just will sit up here and ride for somebody that they don't even fucking know. These people will not come out and pay your bills. And even if they do, once shit hits the fan, they not going to have your back because they don't fucking know you like that. They not about to ride for you. They not about to be out here helping you fight these trolls in your comments or none of that shit. So these blogs really be pissing me off. These blogs and these tarot readers that be talking about celebrities and how they be worshiping celebrities and shit. Like, that shit really irks my soul. Like, it really do. And because I'm nosy, I be watching it. <laughs> I be nosy, okay? I be watching it. Okay? So... <laughs> Y'all need to stop this shit, though. Like, stop this fucking celebrity worship, y'all. For real. Because, let me tell y'all something. They couldn't be nothing without y'all support. Like, they couldn't be nowhere near what they are without y'all support. Like, the music industry wouldn't even support them without y'all supporting them the way that y'all is. Like, a lot of these fan pages, but a lot of these celebrities just be ridiculous. The Beehive, the Barbs, the Barty Gang, y'all just, the whoever's, the whoever's, the whoever's. I'm not about to say your name, all of them, but those are top three. And they really will dox people because people speaking facts or opinions about something about their favorite celebrity like it's really fucking sickening like nikki is not about to come in she's not about to come and knock on your fucking door and fight your battles for you my nigga cardi's not who else is it uh whoever and ain't none of them doing it they not they really not and i just think it's sad because i don't uh i don't pay attention to male rappers like that so i don't know if they're uh uh with some people called they fans is like that in the middle, but you don't, you really don't hear about it. You really just hear about the female fans 
because they really be doxing people, putting out people addresses and shit. Like, is you fucking crazy? You know how much karma, like I said, if somebody dox me, do you know the karma that's going to come from you doxing me? Do you know my ancestors is going to come after that ass? You're going to be sitting around wondering, like, why is my shit falling apart? And you're not even going to think about that you getting attacked spiritually because you went out and started dying. You doxed me. My ancestors don't play. They do not play. <laughs> they don't play. I don't have to do nothing. I could just sit back and watch, my nigga. I don't have to do nothing. My ancestors will get your ass. Period. You won't have shit. You won't get shit. You won't even be able to keep shit. Because my ancestors will make sure it won't happen. So, these people really be out here doing all of this shit. For what? For what? So, this for celebrity can follow you? I don't want no celebrities following me, my nigga. Because I already know what that celebrity energy like. That shit is demonic. Celebrity energy is fucking demonic. Because that's what the type of shit that they play with. They play with that shit. That's how they get people to sheep to pay attention and listen and fight their battles and shit for them. It's a fucking spell, my nigga. Y'all motherfuckers be under spells and be fighting for these people. Like, even <laughs> me, and one, me and my ex-boyfriend like was, was fussing because of fucking Trump. Like, this type of shit, motherfuckers will really be riding for what they believe in real, real hard. For somebody that will not come and do nothing for you. Nothing. Nothing. Absolutely, positively nothing. So for the fact that a lot of people are out here worshiping these celebrities is really just... It's, y'all just gonna get your karma. That's all I'm gonna say. You just gonna get your karma. Like, keep worshiping these people. Keep participating and trying to dox people and all of that shit. And you're gonna get your karma. And you're gonna be sitting back wondering, where the fuck did it come from? Why is all of this shit happening to me? You never gonna look at yourself, though. You're gonna be blaming everybody else. Oh, it's not fair. I ain't do nothing wrong. <laughs> I just seen it happen. I just seen motherfuckers fuck with me and shit happen to them. A boy that used to bully me back in the day is dead. He used to bully me terrible. He's dead now. He doesn't even live to see my age that I'm in right now. So... My ancestors do not play. I don't have to do nothing. I don't practice no negative nothing. I don't have to do nothing but sit back and continue living my life and don't retaliate and don't do no ratchet shit out here in these streets. It's just that simple. So, y'all stop this fucking celebrity worship. These people ain't about to do shit for y'all. They are fucking, they are workhorses for the establishment. They fucking puppets. They will never be free. So this is the type of shit y'all wanted. That's why these motherfuckers is still... Why you think they created verses? These niggas will never not be... They will never not stop working. They can't. They can't until they die. That's why a lot of them be overdosing and shit. You think these people can just walk away? You can't just... Well, you signed your life away. You cannot just walk away. I just was watching something talking about, uh, motherfuckers talking about they retiring. You cannot retire when you in the establishment. You can't. They won't let you. They, they, they might give you the um, impression that you might be retired until they pull your ass to come do some shit like verses. <laughs> I be watching them old motherfuckers doing verses. Like, it's so sad. It's really sad that y'all can't go sit down somewhere and live your life. You can't never live a normal life. You would think that these old ass motherfuckers would go sit down somewhere, but they can't. They can't. They obligated to death. They literally signed a death contract. So, y'all worshiping that shit? Y'all really worshiping that shit? Go find yourself, y'all. Y'all really, some, some of y'all need to really go find yourself. For real. Go find yourself. I ain't never fall hard on no celebrity like that. Not never. I'm not never about to be up in here talking about, yeah, I'm not about to be doxing nobody. I'm not about to be doing none of that for what? Even if that bitch did come knock on my door and give me a fucking check, I tell that bitch no. That's the problem now. 
These motherfuckers don't know how to say no. They be ready to get that dollar. I was just, I was watching something and they was talking about this, this mammy sounding bitch was talking about how this, how the establishment is, is pimping out the men and women and making them put out this type of music. No, the fuck they not. And even if they was, he, listen, this nigga sat at the table. And motherfucker said, look, you got to put out trash music. You got to down your people. You got to do this. You got to do that. That motherfucker still signed that goddamn contract. So, even if that is the case, the motherfuckers is still signing them goddamn contracts. So, they don't give a fuck. They don't give a fuck. I've heard the stories about these so-called rappers talking about, I want to put out more positive music, but they won't let me. It's them. It's them. Yeah, it's them now because you under contract. So, you 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 a slave now. Yeah, you getting pimped out now because you signed your contract. You signed your life away. You signed your death certificate to the industry. So... That's what y'all want to worship. Y'all want to worship people who don't have no freedom. Who will never have the freedom to do what they want to do. They give us the uh, the illusion that they're able to do what they want to do. But they can't. Them niggas can't go withdraw uh, uh, 30000 out the bank without them niggas. Hey. What? 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 You better answer this door. What? 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 You think you know? what you about to do with this 30000 this 25000 They can't just do that so they don't have free reign to do whatever they want to do. They can't even go out here in public without getting harassed and knocked down somewhere. So, y'all want to worship that, though. Celebrity worship is trash. You understand me? Celebrity worship is trash. Sports worship is trash. Y'all out here fighting over shit that you have no control over. All of it is fake. Sports is fake. Celebrities are fake. Entertainment is fake. That's why it's called entertainment. It's to entertain you. It's not real. It's not fucking real. So if y'all running around here betting on games, and matter of fact, <laughs> if you're betting on games, you better be using Gematria. I tell you that you better go learn Gematria so you can figure out how the fuck, uh, 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 um, how you can really come up off winning these games because they all rigged. They all rigged. So if you learn Gematria, you can figure out and you can come up off of that. I, I don't block. I don't blame nobody trying to come up off of it. But if you out here, I'm buying jerseys. Like I had them on the purple head the other day, and this nigga was like, it wasn't even dark purple. It really wasn't even Ravens purple, y'all. But this motherfucker was like, oh yeah, you must be representing for the Ravens, right? I was like, sir, no, if no, I'm not. You cannot wear purple in Baltimore without somebody assuming that you try and represent the fucking Ravens. No, bitch. I wear purple because it's fucking royalty, my nigga. But you wouldn't know that. You wouldn't know that. Fuck a fucking football. I can give a fuck less. I stopped watching football in fucking 2010, my nigga. When I figured out back then, it was either 2010 or 2012. When I figured out on my own, I didn't need your material. All I needed was my common sense. And my common sense told me that shit was rigged. I was in high school. That shit was rigged. I knew basketball was rigged in high school. I haven't watched basketball since high school. I knew that shit was rigged. I knew fucking sports was rigged. So I don't want to watch it no more. What the fuck I'm getting angry for? Y'all niggas begin angry throwing shit at tvs and shit over this over this bullshit you know how much negative energy is getting that energy is getting sucked out of you that that that, 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 that they they put out there that's that's feeding their entities and shit y'all feeding their fucking entities that's what they want this shit is spiritual <laughs> this shit is spiritual this is a fight that you can't even see what the fuck is going on Cause you so busy caught up in celebrity worship and sports worship and all of this fake ass entertainment bullshit that's fake. It's set up for 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 it to affect you emotionally because when you once you're down in a low emotional vibration, then the entities can attack. Then you got niggas out here doing dumb ass shit. Because the entity then got into you because your goddamn vibration then dropped so low because of a goddamn football game or a goddamn baseball game or a goddamn rigged ass basketball game. The shit is all fake. It's all rigged, my nigga. It's all rigged. It's all fake. And every time y'all niggas get upset about these celebrities, every time a celebrity die, every time an entertain, entertainer pass away or get into some drama and y'all get sucked into it and it lowers your vibration, then the entities can attack. 
You don't believe me? You be sitting there, one. You be sitting there, mad. Once you get mad, you watch the uh, fucking football game, baseball game, whatever, and you start getting mad. Then you start thinking about other shit. Where the fuck you think them thoughts is coming from, nigga? You ain't even thinking about the game no more. You thinking about other shit. So let's cut all this. Focus on your motherfucking self. Take your energy out from these celebrities and these entertainers and focus on yourself. Get to know yourself, please. Please. I advise you. Take the time to get to know you. And I'm in this video where it's at. Like, comment, and subscribe. Bring your ass back to the tribe. You already know what the fuck it is. Deuces.